What is up, YouTube? This is I, Best Boss, coming back at you with another video. I know it's been a long time, I think about two weeks since I last uploaded a video. I was away, but I'm back now. Woo! You can clap your hands now. Alright, so this video is going to be showing you iOS 8 Beta 5 new features. There's not a lot, so this one's going to be a quick little video. Let's get started. So let's get started in iCloud. So you can see they changed the iCloud drive and backup and keychain all to blue icons, which is kind of neat. So the next new feature is iCloud Photo Library in the photo section in iCloud. What it does is it stores all your photos in iCloud and I can choose to either keep it in your photos app and both on your iCloud. So if you want to have them both, just because then you can hide. And if you don't want them, if you have no space in your iPhone, then like I don't, like I do, because as you can see when you turn it on, no storage. So then you can just upload them all to iCloud and delete them from your photo library directly. So that's a nice, neat other feature. So next feature is in messages or any app that uses predictive text. Now you can hold your emoji icon and you can see the predictive text toggle. It's on for me, so the only one who, you know what. And then you can, you know, just turn it off if you want. Right there. You can either swipe up, turn it on, swipe to turn it off. And that permanently hides it from your keyboard if you don't like predictive text. The last thing in iOS 8 Beta 5, which is a nice feature, is quicker spotlight search. So, it's really quick. It doesn't get the whole bounce thing, it's just so quick, so fast. So whatever you need to search, it's right here for you, ready to go. So that's pretty much it for the iOS 8 Beta 5 features. Again, it's not a really big update, and there hasn't been much bugs with this update. So Apple may not release the iOS 8 Beta 6 after all, but if they do, it will be released today at some time, August 18th. And if it's not, then, you know, iOS 8 is coming closer to being released to the public. And so is the iPhone 6. See you guys later, and please subscribe to my channel, I Invest Boss. Peace out, y'all.